So it's day five, and I still haven't showered, and I still haven't changed my clothes. Saturday now. Matthew called a one one today to get some clarification about the amount of isolation days. Because we keep hearing different things. Some people are like, that's 10, it's 5, it's 7. I know in other provinces right now, they just switched to 5, like Ontario. Uh, Dad said Alberta is doing it, Saskatchewan. Uh, Vancouver is doing it as well. Um, so we just needed some clarification. So when he spoke with 811, it, yes, it is still 10 days isolation. However, since he's tested positive yesterday, I don't have to restart my 10 days. As long as your 10 days are up and you're not showing symptoms, then you can go out. Uh, Matthew still has to do his 10 days. Cleo still has to do her 10 days. But now I haven't had to change my 10 days, which means I get out on Thursday. They still have to do the rest of their 10 days, which will um, be different from each other's. It's fucking stupid. I'm on day five now and all my symptoms are pretty much gone. Excuse me. The only thing that I uh, am suffering with is that I cannot taste anything. Still. Nothing. Nothing. It's fucking pointless, really, to eat. Like, what the fuck is the point? Because can't taste anything. Each morning I wake up praying, Yay, today's the day I'm going to taste. Nope. Anyways, everybody's still feeling all right. Um, Cole, again, this is his day three. No symptoms. Um, Cleo's still sleeping, so I'm not sure how she is today. Matthew, this is Matthew's second day. He's still feeling a little, a little yucky. Um, headache. Uh, he's got a cough now. Uh, his body's a little sore. <clears throat> um, but he slept a lot last night. Uh, he went to bed super early, slept in this morning, so uh, he's not feeling as crappy, but still kind of crappy. Uh, anyways, I'm ready to be done this, and it's only five day, or day five. I'm done. Let me out. I want to go out. <sighs> Stay safe.